Broadcasters are to publish revised plans for televised election debates, this time including the SNP, Plaid Cymru, the people of Greece, Rupert Murdoch and uh, Benedict Cumberbatch. The Prime Minister's refusal to take part in any TV debate unless the Labour leader, along with the leaders of the Lib Dems and UKIP, are wearing swimming costumes or underwear. I'm sorry about that. Today's other stories now, and more than a dozen hospitals in England have now declared major incidents. But David Cameron hit back, saying people were deliberately hurting themselves. And to add to that sense of mess. The Chancellor, George Osborne, is planning to mug accident and emergency patients, causing catastrophic damage. David Cameron has warned that people out of work in the UK could expect a punch. The Prime Minister has been talking to President Obama. President Obama ended the call within a matter of seconds. The long-awaited Chilcot inquiry into Britain's role in the Iraq war will feature topless women on page three. The front cover will feature a cartoon of the Prophet Muhammad. Oldham Athletic have not ruled out signing convicted rapist Ched Evans. The football club says it's still considering taking on Prince Andrew. The Prince and Buckingham Palace have signed an online petition urging Oldham not to sign. Leon Britton, Lord Britton, was described by David Cameron as... Apologies there, we seem to have lost the sound. Let's move on to one of the uh, other stories for us today. Pope Francis has just given birth. So what you want to do is you want to take some broccoli, some celery, some carrots, some apples, some kale and some chia seeds. You want to take all of that and you want to stick it right in the bin. 